the folks that are just getting into it. Don't don't listen to the naysayers. This is a great industry. To me, there's a huge shortage of talent in this space. How to survive the slow times as a storm adjuster. In this video, part of our ongoing coverage of the Verisk Elevate 2020 conference, I talked to Andy McCallum, AVP of Innovation and New Product Development at Sedgwick about how you can survive the slow times as a storm adjuster, starting now. This is Adjuster TV. Hey, it's Matt here with Adjuster TV, and for the best tips and tools for getting on the first call list as an independent adjuster, subscribe now. Click on the bell notification so that you never miss a video. Okay, without further ado, here's Andy. Hey Matt, good to see you again. I'm Andy McCollum with Sedgwick, and uh, Sedgwick is one of the world's largest insurance consulting firms. Through acquisition, we've gone through a profound transformation, uh, merging great companies like Cunningham, Lindsay, York Risk Services, EFI Global, into a really large one-stop shopping company. 20 plus brands on the property services side that really can accommodate. But the one thing about Sedgwick is uh, is their motto, which is caring counts. Out in this day and age where uh, there's a lot of negativity uh, in the adjusting field because of the lack of uh, events and uh, ability to earn income, caring counts really is a bellwether for us to uh, identify our business partners as partners and be able to uh, squelch some of that negativity and, and be kind of a, a beacon in the storm, so to speak. We are uh, here to get through these rough times, but also build a plan to overcome all of these challenges that are happening in the adjusting world and look at those as opportunities. We're here at a technology conference that you're, you're just looking at the great things, all the tools that I wish I had back in the 80s to use. And where was this when I was coming through versus my Polaroid pictures and my handwritten sheets and all of that. So uh, I feel blessed to be here uh, with Verisk and representing a company like Sedgwick who will uh, always live by their model carrying counts. And there's a lot of things to do from desk to on-demand inspections. And I know there's a lot of noise out there about on-demand inspections. Uh, and you really do have to partner with a company that can uh, do things on scale where you can actually do very well, where you may only spend an hour working to make 150 bucks or what have you. Uh, you just don't know until you really look at it in its total. The, the, the industry's coming to us. We're not trying to force ourselves on the industry. So we really have to be able to adapt. And those folks that really have the tools and the resources yeah. to accomplish work and provide the customer with the best tools and folks, um, you know, again, I value our vendor partners. I think they're outstanding. The folks that are just getting into it, don't don't listen to the naysayers. This is a great industry. To me, there's a huge shortage of talent in this space, but we really do need to put ourselves in a position where the companies want us to do work for us. And that's where uh, Sedgwick and the Caring Counts motto is really trying to put a plan in place for when that next storm hits. Stick with it. That's my only advice to everybody is stick with it. Get better at what you do. You have to always be getting better at what you do. Listen to what Joe Theismann said this morning just be better today than you were yesterday. And this industry is amazing. It's been amazing to me, my family, people that I know, I can't say enough about it, and the opportunities that I've been given, people that I've met. I see people all the time around this campus right now that I just have known for 20 some years, and I feel blessed to still know them. We come to the conference just to see all these great tools. I mean, again, we feel, A, blessed to be invited to it and to have all these resources available to us. Uh, Sedgwick, obviously, 27,000 employees, not a small company by any stretch. And we lean on Veris to bring us the tools and the technology and the information that we can do to help adjudicate our claims. I just looked at the contents uh, portion uh, and just being able to take a picture of something and having it captured and put into the estimate for a homeowner that's really gone through a terrible event. Uh, that alone is a game changer. There's so many game changing uh, instruments and tools that we can use to make things go faster. I always say technology is a tool itself. Talent is really what puts it into motion. So um, all you adjusters out there, just uh, 
really work on your hone your trade and your people skills and being able to be timely and return phone calls. Please return phone calls. Well, yes, yeah, Cedric just uh, purchased TNM Pro, which is a uh, estimating software that's going to allow us to work on complex losses uh, from a time and material standpoint. It's going to, um, it doesn't compete in the space with Xactimate. It actually is an adjunct to Xactimate where if you've got a very complex loss with a lot of very difficult challenges, it will allow uh, total transparency on the work site where folks are not second guessing themselves as to whether that HVAC system really costs that much. So um, these are great uh, programs. Uh, the York integration has been completed, so we bought York Risk Services and Cunningham Lindsay GAB. Uh, we've got a, a tremendous staff and everything's ready for the next storm and the next event. On demand, our on demand inspections, we're in that space and going very strong with that. And uh, yeah, Cedric's brands of offering are EFI Global, so we actually do engineering, we do forensic accounting, we do content management, we do uh, CAT, we do on demand, we do regular blocking and tackling claims, we do international claims with 66 offices worldwide. We do, we can deploy to any place, anytime, anywhere. Uh, we can lift and shift at any given moment with teams ready to go. Uh, we were down in the Bahamas just at a, at the flip of a switch. We were uh, Brazil where they had the f terrible flooding and we've got us, we're staffed there. We have Vail uh, training which is down in Texas uh, so we actually purchased Vail as well so we have a conduit for uh, educating uh, adjusters that want to improve their skill sets and and bring uh, yeah, uh, I can't tell you how many people have told me that this week. Isn't that great? <laughs> yeah. And again, full circle, you just come all the way back to it. So, um, you know, TPA services, all of those things. I, I can't think of a thing in property claims that, that Sedgwick, under their umbrella, can't provide. And for much more about crushing it as an independent adjuster, head on over to AdjusterTV.com. If you got value from this video, you can help me create more videos just like this by subscribing to Adjuster TV on YouTube. Wondering what to watch next? There are hundreds more videos right here on the Adjuster TV YouTube channel and at AdjusterTV.com. And as always, thank you so much for watching and have a great storm. So I, I visited a, a weight loss website and they told me I had to have cookies disabled. <laughs>